How many people do you know these days with a neurological disorder? How many family members or people in your circle of friends have something like fibromyalgia or lupus? How about a brain tumor? Studies in the New England Journal of Medicine show a growing trend in the rate of such disorders in recent years. I also became a statistic when I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. It was the summer of the Great Fire in Tucson, Arizona, when I began my research and traveled across this country to find the truth. And again, it, it's this variability in your sensitivity to toxins. Some people may notice very little of anything. A majority of people will have one of a number of symptoms because we know that the aspartame, because it is a poison that affects protein synthesis, because it affects the, how the synapse operates in the brain, and because it affects DNA, can affect numerous organs. So you can get a lot of different symptoms that seem unconnected. 